What's up guys, it's Hotdive7RCT bringing you another video and today I'm going to be bringing you yet another Warframe video. This time around I'm going to be covering the PC side of things, which is kind of ironic uh, considering that I kind of like went full on full in the Switch version and I still am. Don't get me wrong, that's still my preferred way of playing for now, but I have to admit guys, I mean, as of late, after doing the upgrade to the PC, I've been getting this itch, you know, on the graphic side of things, if you know what I mean, like experiencing Warframe at a higher resolution, more effects, stuff like that. Now, to make matters worse, after I did the upgrade, um, the guys at Digital Streams decided to like in honor of making these tweaks and updates and stuff like that to the main game um, and on all platforms by the way you know PC and the consoles they decided to you know go a step further as they're going through their roadmap of changes throughout the year and they announced you know the remastering of the planes planes of Eidolon in, uh, in Warframe now this of course being the PC version uh, it's later coming on for the consoles at what date is still at this point hasn't been specified but the thing is that they're they, they kind of announced it with a trader very nice very you know hyping it up uh, that and I'm still waiting for the railjack thing which was amazing by the way from last year um, but to the point they did a remaster they did um, new assets new textures and stuff like that adding new life to the planes so basically given that the timing is perfect because around the same time that I do the upgrade to my PC I want to test this out uh, especially if I can now you know go in and indulge in the 4k 60 frames per second kind of deal I wanted to test how far I could go so basically that's the reason of this video is to show you guys give you a look how much of a change is it now you can do a comparison of course with the um, footage that I have uh, the switch version to make com um, comparisons even though I I think it would be a more fair comparison to compare it to the old version and the new regardless of that let's go into this and hope you guys like it um, by the way thanks for the support so far uh, I'm, I'm glad that you guys like the, the videos that I've done so far uh, with on the PC side of things because it's something that I kind of left behind. I got so focused on doing Switch stuff alone, but don't worry, I'm going to be doing much more things. I have a lot of things planned out and I'm working on them right now. So everything that um, involves RCT as a whole. Um, you're going to be seeing a lot more of that coming up soon, including emulation. So stay tuned for that. For now, let's go into the planes. All right, guys. So let's, uh, let's try this out. We're in the game already. Now, for clarification... And by the way, I know a lot uh, a lot of people who have been in Warframe for a long time are going to recognize I'm still using here because this is my old account on PC. I don't have much. I'm basically like I have nothing. Like I have a few Platinum and a few credits, but I only have like Excalibur and stuff like that because I moved my original account, which was starting, by the way, to the Switch. So every single thing that I have is on the Switch and... Seeing this kind of makes me, it's, it's a pain for me, to be honest, because I really would like to, I, I don't know, I would like um, Digital Extreme, if you're watching this by any chance, or anybody close to them, <clears throat> please bring cross saves to the Switch and PC that you can move, you know, I, I know I'm, I'm being a little selfish for not saying make it overall, but <clears throat> if you can do this favor for me, please, please, because I would love to bring the stuff that I have over there, over here from time to time, you know? But it's okay, guys. You've been doing a wonderful job, and I can't complain. To be honest, I can't complain. But let's go into the planes because I can see that it's going to become nighttime in an hour. 
So let's see. Hopefully with the recording, the performance will go down. I believe that is the case, but you never know. Kind of seems like night already. I might be wrong, but night in one hour. I can tell right away, just going by the by the ground textures. I mean, everything seems very very crisp. Foliage and you know stuff looks very 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 clear. Now, I don't know to what extent they made changes, and of course after playing the Switch version for so long already. It's like, wow. Another thing, of course, is since most of my stuff is over there at, um, on the Switch version, I can't use like my arch wing and, and stuff like that or the K drive and all that stuff so I have to go walking everywhere so bear in mind that okay so I am I'm guessing that I got into a point oh okay 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 I, I see I think I misinterpreted what the message was saying it said night in one hour but I think what it meant was the night will be over in an hour because it seems to me like it's basically um, sunrise. It's getting to the point of sunrise. Oh yeah, I can feel the light coming in. I think this is one example. Yep, textures have been given a nice little revamp. Let's do a. You pay me in red. I pay you in silver. And I'll probably get my ass kicked because I'm very low level and don't have much. But what the hell? Let's give it some action here. Quills are at it again, telling me an important Orican relic is being unearthed by the Grenier. The Quills would like this relic back, and I would like to keep the Quills happy. Where am I going? Are you oblige? Yes, of course. Tell me where to go. Details about this relic and its whereabouts are scarce. I need you to do some digging. At my waypoint, All you'll right. find the commander responsible for taking the relic. Eliminate him. Let's go there. Oh man, this is like the best. I actually get the full effect of night turning into day. So yeah, I guess the timing was perfect guys.
Okay, so we're here. Oh my god, the water in this thing is insane. So I gotta kill 15 enemies. Oh, I'm not gonna take that down. Holy crap, he's far away. How the hell am I supposed to bring him from up there? I'm chipping away, I'm chipping away. There you go. Escape out of here. Our latest intel points to the armored vault at my waypoint. Break in and look for the relic. All right, guys. I think you guys got a pretty clear idea of how nice everything is looking here. I mean, just a simple fact of a little trunk here that gives out all of that detail yeah i have to admit it's really you know all, all kidding aside it really looks beautiful everything from the water ground textures and stuff enemies everything looks really nice really detail and everything it just moves oh i'm in awe i'm in awe guys but yeah, that's gonna that's gonna basically cover it. I just wanted to give you a, a quick look at how this looks. Uh, hopefully, uh, we'll have more updates soon. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed this, and I'm gonna see you guys next time. Stay tuned because a lot more is coming up. I think um, I'm gonna be working as soon as I'm done here. I'm gonna be working on bringing you guys back to speed up with uh, emulation in 2019 so stay tuned for that that's going to be very interesting uh thanks a lot guys see you guys later take care and thanks a lot please like and subscribe bye